Spells, spells, spells. So for today, uh, for today's dinner, I'll be having my OG favorite Samyang uh, Korean fried noodle. So I used to like this a lot, and then I transitioned to the carbonara. You know, then after that, I got sick of the carbonara, and I'm back for this. So I've been craving for this since Vietnam. So aside from this, I'll be pairing it with fried tauki and meatballs. Um, why? Because I didn't uh, put it in the freezer, so I have to actually consume it by today, so it doesn't uh, doesn't go spoil. But yeah, so let me cook it, and I'm gonna show you. Peace. Hey, my transition failed. Alright, so first off, I got my pot and I'm gonna cook the ingredients first. Just gonna cook the ingredients. Meatballs in. Okay. Still, still, still edible, still edible. Um, Tauki as well. Tauki as well, Tauki as well. So side note, right? So I just, uh, so I failed my driving test in December. I failed my driving test in December, and okay, that was my first driving uh, test, first TP test, and then uh, when I rebooked it, I need to uh, I spent thirty three dollars. I put thirty three dollars into my CDC account um, to actually book. To actually let my instructor book then little do i know that the whole thing costs 570 excluding the 33 dollars so the tp test now is actually 603 dollars oh my god 603 dollars okay so i think what's the funny thing was when i was driving right oh my god this was i think this is the funniest story ever so um, there are six stations. So when I went through the circuit, the first station that I went through was the S-Course, right? So after coming out of the S-Course, he told me to go to the slope course. Then apparently, according to him, I shouldn't have turned, I shouldn't have formed up uh, way earlier. So in the end, uh, actually at that moment, after my first course, I actually filled the test already. But he was nice enough to let me Continue, uh, continue for everything. Then it turns out it was quite an L when I was doing my uh, directional change, which is the three point turn, right? When I was doing everything, okay, all's good. But when I was moving out, oh my god, I'm on curb. So immediate failure. But then again, that was like my third or fourth station. He allowed me to finish everything. He was super nice, and uh, yeah, and that's how I lose six hundred dollars in. An hour or so. Uh, I was really very nervous, but uh, yeah, I was super nervous. I don't know why my heart was like coming out of my chest, but yeah, that was an experience. Um, total number of lessons I took was twenty one. Currently, I spent including six hundred plus. I think close to three thousand uh, dollars, which is quite a lot. I'm I'm doing a class three, which is manual. Um, I'm gonna have my lesson. Okay, so the funny le funny thing about it was last year when I booked the lesson with him, right? To go into a circuit. So the total lesson, total duration of the lesson was one and a half hours. And then uh, including circuit was $138 of 42. Can't really remember. But this time round, this year, is 120. Okay? But back in November, he was telling me like, oh, I'm gonna raise my race because the petrol cost is high, then everything is high and stuff but then again i'm like hmm i mean i'm not gonna s complain anything about like the lower driving um lesson cost but it's 120 but i'm probably gonna book two more lessons before my exam in march so to really like get my gear going because i haven't been driving for driving for like a month or so already so this thursday at 7 a.m cdc i'll be there driving so that is crazy itself because it's so early but yeah, it is what it is. But I actually requested for like a ex extremely, like for a time whereby there is no one to disturb me and stuff. So, and I think that's probably why he recommended, he's, he recommended 7. So he recommended 7, 12 or 4. I think 
Um, I think seven is a bit early, but as long as I can, uh, you know, in, not have so many people, it'll be better. Because I don't don't really want, you know, if I go later, then I have to queue and wait. But if it's early, then I can just keep trying and trying and trying and trying and yeah. So that's that. Hopefully, I get my driving license before I graduate. Cause that's one of actually one of the few things that I want to wanted to achieve before my graduation. So it was driving license. That's number one. Um, getting a job before graduation was another one. Um, accumulating enough CPF uh, money in my OE account to start my investment with um, yeah start my investment because after the threshold of twenty thousand you can actually use your CPF money to invest so that was actually one of my goal and I managed to achieve it um, I managed to achieve it last year so that's that um, yeah so now this is the progress of the ingredients. It is all cooked. I am gonna fish them out real soon. And then I am also going to add, this is the hot pots must have, Ling Ling Chuan. So I'm gonna add that in when I cook finish the Samyang. So that's that. I'm gonna take this out and then I'll put the uh, noodles in. Alright, I'm still use, I'm using the water from the ingredients So, time to put our noodles in Okay Turn the heat up a bit Toss it So now it looks like this. So I like to be really precise with the time. So I'm gonna find out the time now. I can actually scroll down actually. Alright, so we will let it sit for 5 minutes so that uh, at 8.32, uh, I'll mix in, I'll put this in and then I'll mix it all up and yeah. Alright, one more minute and I'm gonna, now I'm gonna add the, add this. Let me just... Anymore, it's like that. It's, it's like that. So, oops. No, I cannot use ultra white now. Oops. Uh, I'm just gonna put three. Oh my phone. Oh my phone. Oh no. Four. I'm gonna put four. Okay. Right. Then we just put this in. Okay. Actually, we can stop the fire. All right. I'm gonna drain it. And I'll show you soon. Choo. All right. So drain the noodles. I don't like to leave any soup behind. Actually, so. So I'm gonna, just gonna drain it till there's little to no water. Usually I drain until there's no water. I use the lid to remove the water, but I don't know what's the lid. I'm too lazy to get. And be careful that your noodles might sit down. So, okay, that's that. Now we have this mountain of uh, ingredients. I'm just gonna mix it here also. So see, it's 
see the noodles. Okay, a few drops is okay, I guess. Then, oh, almost, 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 almost. Okay, honestly, I seldom cook, so it's one of the rare times I cook. But uh, yeah, since I'm cooking, might as well meet the. Oops, my phone's gonna fall. Um, yep, now it's like that. What I need to do, add the sauce in. Add the sauce in. Are you gonna throw a trash? Okay, wait down, wait down, wait down. My god! Okay, I should take out my shirt first. Can you take out my shirt? Okay, because it was, it's white, so I don't want to ruin it. I might ruin it. Oh my god, this is... Yeah, and one thing about me is I don't like to use uh, scissors when it comes to these kind of sauces. So that's that. But since I am left with no choice, so I'm just going to use the scissors. Okay, simply because I don't like to stain the scissors, but yeah. Put here, drizzle the sauce, everything. I use your MacBook. Ah. Okay. And instead of just garnishing it when I'm done stirring it, I will put in to stir as well. Alright. Seems like I should have used a bowl instead because it's like a bit too small but it is what it is. Alright. And you can mix it up. Mix it up. Mix it up. Okay. I like to let it cool because sometimes the water is retained and then it's like very, uh, what do you call it? Like soupy. I don't really like it. But uh, as can be seen from here, from my point of view, it is a little bit soupy because of the ingredients. So I'm probably just going to let it sit or I'm going to transfer it to another bowl. Gee, yeah, let me transfer it to a bowl. What are you getting, huh? Okay, that might just text me. Alright, transferring to this bowl. And, oh my god. Oh my god. Here we go. Ah, oh, look at that. I think it's easier to mix with a bowl. Why didn't I think of that? Now I have more things to clean, more things to wash. Okay, done. Okay. Oh my god, it looks so good. But I'm gonna let it sit. That's that. And uh, all the moisture is actually coming from the bean cut skin. So, yep, thank you. And so this is the finishing product. We have the meatballs, beancurt uh, fried tauki, beancurt skin, and some young noodles. And no, I won't be filming myself eating because uh, I just want to eat in peace today. Um, there's nothing much to say also. And hopefully, some people watch me, some people don't. I don't know, but yeah. See you.